Hi, Libra. Tarot Scope. Happy New Year. And the deck I am using is Shadowscape Tarot. Lovely design. Beautiful cards. And the spread I am going to do for you is the Gypsy Spread. So first I will deal out three rows of seven cards starting from the right to the left. And I'm going to try to make sure they all get on the screen. There. Next row. So the first column I'm going to look at is the, you have the Nine of Swords reversed, the Lover's card, and the King of Cups. You are a water sign, so you are the King of Cups. So this is you, you are being you, you are being very um, in control of your emotions. You know when to use them, show them, and you know how valuable and how strong emotions can be. And you know how to share them and to help other people express theirs. There is a situation, a relationship that you have that you are showing and sharing your emotions with very much. You have the Nine of Swords reversed. This situation is removing anxiety that you have had in the past. So things are starting out the month really good. Your state of mind is really good going into January. Your home life, you have Five of Pentacles reversed, Knight of Wands, and Knight of Pentacles reversed. So the, both of the Pentacles are reversed. You, in the past, you have felt shut out. You have had financial problems, but in your home life, and this is no longer an issue. You have um, overcome this, this financial situation. You still aren't in total control of your finances and your resources and your earthly possessions. It could be your, your time, your energy, your friendships. There is a fire sign around you. And that is an Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo. And they are in the upright. They have this strength, this desire, this drive. They are in your home life at this time. And they are being that rock for you. While you are going through this financial issue, you are finally overcoming it. Your desires for the month is Ace of Cups reversed, Knight of Swords, and Queen of Cups. Your desires 
with Knight of Swords is to speak your mind, to speak what needs to be said, to show with the Queen of Cups, to show that love, that passion, that um, help the people close to you, your family, your friends, the ones you care for dearly with their emotions, to express your emotions to them. And with the Ace of Cups reversed, your desire is to not have your love and your compassion be ignored and not reciprocated. A lot of times when I see the Ace of Cups reversed, I think of love and passion that is not being returned. Like you are giving out love, but you are not getting it back. So your desire is to get that love that you have been given out to express yourself emotionally and mentally what you expect to happen in the month you have the devil card six of swords and seven of pentacles the devil is vices is things that we tend to do in excess things that make us feel good but then we become addicted to them and we do them in excess it could be sex drugs rock and roll whatever alcohol um, now people are addicted to the internet to playing games video games to there's so many things that we may enjoy doing but when you do things in excess then that's when the devil steps in then it becomes an addiction almost anything can become an addiction if you let it control your world and it, you revolve everything around it so this is what you expect to happen in the month of january you expect to continue with these vices that you have been making yourself happy and placating yourself. You expect to walk away from a situation that has been confusing and troublesome to a situation which isn't so troublesome, is clearer, is easier for you to understand, and a happier place. You expect to have to be patient and watch as you toil and you get benefits from all your hard work. From those investments, it could be your finances, it could be your investment in your time, it could be your investment in your love, it could be anything you have invested yourself into. You need to be patient to watch some returns on it. This is what you are expecting to happen in the month. What is going to surprise you in the month is the tower reversed. Ten of pentacles reversed. And six of wands. It's going to surprise you that that situation in the past that rocked your world some situation just crumbled just collapsed around you it was an external force something that you didn't have total control over it could have been somebody around you um, had something devastating happen like their their house caught on fire or it could be your apartment building that caught on fire it could be an external situation but you are overcoming this situation now. There was some family inheritance or, or resources, financial resources or resources that you were expecting. But it's surprising you that it's not there. It's not there when you need it. But you are going to have some kind of victory. Some kind of moral victory, some kind of victory in the end. And this is going to surprise you also. People are going to say, good job, way to go. 
they are going to congratulate you and and praise you for your accomplishments maybe getting over this this tower this situation which was very traumatizing and overcoming this family support and resources finances it could be support in general because pentacles don't always have to refer to finances it could mean your time your energy your friendship your your resources your soon to be future by the end of January, you have Ace of Pentacles reversed, the Fool reversed, and Judgment reversed. So there is a situation that you wanted to start, a beginning to something that you thought was going to develop and grow into something either financially fulfilling for you or it could be just grow and develop into some of those earthly resources grow and make it bigger it was a direction you wanted to take but this has both been delayed it has all been delayed in this situation you feel you have been treated unjustly and you are not seeing justice being done you you have the judgment card reversed and you're not seeing that. You're not seeing how there is going to be that that um, new beginning, that new, because you want to go this new direction. You want this new start. You aren't going to see that. Something wrong has happened, something unjust, something that isn't going your way at this time. So by the end of the month, what you wanted to start and materialize, maybe your New Year's resolution, isn't actually materializing the way you want. It's been postponed and it's not happening the way you wanted. Could be because of your long-term outcome, which you have Three of Swords, King of Swords reversed, and three of pentacles. So you got two threes here. Two threes are very trying number. Because you can see with the three of swords, there is something happens. You are going to feel like somebody stabbed you, like they hurt you. They they hurt you in your heart, in your in your um deep personally it was something that you weren't expecting it could be this king of swords swords are air signs air signs are aquarius uh, libra and gemini they all are about their thoughts their minds and their opinions their wants their needs and this king of swords is walk working in the reversal they're being selfish, they're being um, self-centered, they are just thinking of themselves. They don't care about other people's needs or wants, they're just being childish. But you are still working hard and trying to, trying to overcome this situation. Because if it is a relationship, you have to work hard at the relationship. Work hard at understanding this situation. So within a couple months, something is going to come to a head and you're going to need to address it. I hope you have an overall really good and I am really looking forward to talking to you again in February. Bless you all.